We're going to have a good time. Hi guys, Todd here. Today we are going to be doing an unboxing. Uh, when I say an unboxing, that's all it is. This is not a review. I have not tested this. I have not even opened the box at all. I, in fact, I know very, very little about it. So this is a journey with me and you unboxing something for the first time and I will give you a minimal amount of information about it. I will then test the product for a week or two and then come back and do a full review. So this is just to give you a heads up on something. So let's do some close-ups. So here we go with the Senesis by Innokin. So, uh, hiking this off, uh, we have some this whole Find F thing that's going on. I'll talk about this a bit more at the end. But uh, once again, as always with the uh, Innokin and all the recent recent products, you know everything's paper, so you can chuck it straight in your paper bin. There's no plastic or anything in here. Uh, once again, we have this uh, Find F Club. We shall find a USB, hopefully a USB C. Is it? Yes, it is. It's a USB C cable because I think this is an internal battery. We have a scepter. 0 0.65 ohm coils. We've been using scepter coils for a little while now. No issue with them. Uh, mouth to lung pieces and whatnot in here. We'll have a look in the bag in a sec. And one manual. So the device itself. Uh, we've got the what I've liked about Inica in the past. It looks like we've got a firing bar here. Yep, we have indeed. And there you go. You can see it's come up with sensors. So it's usually three clicks to lock and unlock with an Inica device. So one, two, three. And there we go. We're straight in. I'll get the, the protective screen off of here just now, just to make it look a little bit cleaner. Love that bit. And as I thought, yeah, this is uh, an internal battery. And uh, going off here, it is a 3000 milliamp hour battery, internal. So you're not going to take this out and charge it. You will be charging it via the USB-C. And hopefully this is going to be about a 2 amp charge. But I'll confirm that in the review. We've got a bit of padded, uh, fake kind of carbon fiber look going on here. And that's that's actually quite nice, that. That's quite nice, that. Looks like we've got a airflow control at the back here. So I'm guessing that this is a pod. Uh, how do we get this pod off? I have no idea. We just pull. It's, it's magic. So pulling this out of here... Uh, what coil is this? They did send on uh, other ones. So basically, I think that this is going to be taking these coils. So you're going to have uh, bum, 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 scepter coils and S coils. I think both are going to work in here. And we're looking at a restricted direct lung to a mouth to lung type draw. It's going to be one of these bottom fill ones. Uh, you know, I'm not always a huge fan of them, but uh, you know, just pick that open here and yep we'll fill it through here this looks like a TPD one it's got a plastic bung in it I'm kind of hoping that uh, I'll be able to take this to bits and get that bung out but I shall try that at a later date now I'm pretty sure that I read in the other little packet that there was there is uh, a 510 adapter as well now is this just going to be magnetic it is it's magnetic uh, and it's fitted in there. Let's find another tank. I'll just quickly stick on my Skyline just now. A Skyline R. And that is just spinning round. I, I imagine, oh hang on, here we go. Yeah, I mean if you want to take your tank off you just take that off and unscrew it. Job done. Uh, so yeah, that makes perfect sense. Okay, put that back on there and yeah, that's firing away and well, there we go. Right, so we have a device that comes with a 510 adapter. You can use your own tank on it. And it also comes with, and this looks like glass as well. Uh, we have a glass pod, which obviously this one will be a two milliliter capacity. So before we go back up top, just in here, push the plus and minus button, and it should take us into the menu screen. And you can see we've got power, coil plus, and refresh. I'm going to talk about them in a second and there's a little padlock there as well. Now as I said this was an unboxing video only. Uh, I do have that little coil in there which now that I've put the right doodah on it I can actually use it and I'm at 17 watts. I've got the airflow fully open and this is uh, quite a lot of air. In fact that's a direct lung um, and Uh, I'm sure once I've bed this coil in, I'll get a lot more vapour out of it, but I I'm actually very surprised at the amount of air. Just closing it down, I'm actually that, oh, 
That is tight. Be curious to see what this is like with a mouth to lung coil in it because adjusting this airflow in the back is closing the air off altogether. I mean, there's no air passing through it at all. So we'll see what that's like during testing. Now, the one thing that there is, there's three settings. There's two settings that we can see. There's a coil plus and there's a refresh and there's a padlock. Now this find F thing that you see branded about everywhere. Apparently there's a setting on this device that's a new feature in the vaping world. You go along to the Facebook group, you will find out how to unlock that setting. I have my opinion on this. I'll not share it. I'll wait until the review. There's some trick features that have gone into this device. I have all the paperwork explaining how it works. I'll not bore you to death now, but keep an eye out for the review because there is some interesting stuff going on with, with this mod. Uh, once again, it's about, what's it, 3000 milliamp hour inbuilt battery. We've got a glass pod at the top. It comes with a 510 adapter mouth to lung coils, restricted direct, direct lung with it, you can cover the whole thing apparently and it's got that usual bar thing that we've seen on other Inikin mods as well and it's freeing up. When I took it out the box it was pretty clunky but even now it's feeling a lot better. But that's it, the Senesis by Inikin, review to come very very soon. Thank you for watching as always and bye for now.